Hello, my name is Ava Marinos, and I'm a volunteer here aboard the USS Hornet. Behind me is a Sikorsky UH-34D helicopter, and I'm gonna tell you all about it. The Sikorsky H-34, first introduced in 1954, flew with all four branches of the armed forces. The H-34 was used in a wide variety of roles, including anti-submarine warfare, search and rescue, troop transport, and as a medevac for wounded soldiers and Marines. H-34s were the last piston-engined helicopter to be operated by the United States Marine Corps. A total of 2,108 H-34s were manufactured between 1953 and 1970. They were retired from service in the early 1970s, with the Marines being the last to service to operate UH-34Ds in 1973. Helicopter Anti-Submarine Squadron 8, known as HS-8, served aboard the USS Hornet flying the Seabat, the U.S. Navy H-34 model for use in finding enemy submarines on the 1959 Far East cruise. The patch for HS-8, the Eight Ballers, consists of a winged gauntlet glove holding a chain. On the other end of the chain is a spiked eight ball piercing an enemy submarine. Helicopter Anti-Submarine Squadron 2, known as HS-2, flew the same model sea bats while conducting anti-submarine operations on the 1960 Westpac cruise. The patch for HS-2, the Golden Falcons, consists of a falcon carrying a bomb while listening for enemy submarine activity. This particular aircraft is a Marine Corps UH-34D. It was assigned to HMM-363, the Lucky Red Lions. They were a Marine Corps medium helicopter squadron and served in Vietnam from December 27, 1965 to June 22, 1967. Based at Quy Nan and Chu Lai airfields, YZ-63 participated in combat strikes, search and rescue, medevacs, and resupply missions. YZ-63 was hit by enemy fire on seven of its missions and still has the repair patches showing where it was hit by ground fire. After being land-based, HMM-363 flew off the USS Okinawa LPH-3 as part of a SLF or Special Landing Force. The HMM-363 patch consists of a red lion inside a white four-leaf clover. The name, Lucky Red Lions, was given to the squadron by Republic of Korea Marines while working together during Operation Flying Tiger in 1965. Until next time, this is Ava Marinos. Thank you for watching and come by for a tour sometime.